Elizabeth Shaughnessy Cohen was a lawyer and the first female member of parliament elected from Windsor. Miss Cohen was raised in the small town of Thamesville, Ontario, where her father, Bruce Murray, operated the local pharmacy and served as a school board trustee. From early in her life, she was exposed to politics. Lester B. Pearson and Pierre Trudeau were personal heroes. She studied at the University of Windsor and later entered private law practice in Windsor after being admitted to the bar in 1979. Prior to running for public office, Ms. Cohen also worked part-time as assistant crown attorney and federal prosecutor for the County of Essex. In addition, she was past president of Hiatus House and sat on the board of Brentwood Recovery Home, Hospice of Windsor, and the Infant and Family Program of Windsor in Essex County. Ms. Cohen came to Ottawa as part of the federal liberal suite of 1993, defeating the incumbent Howard McCurdy for the riding of Windsor St. Clair. In 1997, she was easily re-elected. Ms. Cohen distinguished herself in committee work, including serving as the chair for the Standing Committee on Justice and Human Rights. While in office, she earned the reputation as an outspoken and tenacious parliamentarian. In private, she was witty as well as enthusiastic. Ms. Cohen was married to Jerome Cohen, a professor of the University of Windsor. Ms. Cohen died of a burst aneurysm collapsing at her seat in the House of Commons on December 9, 1998. In 2000, as a tribute to Ms. Cohen, the Writers' Trust of Canada established a prize in her name to recognize authors of nonfiction works that capture a subject of Canadian political interest.